Hi, I am Hannu Vahokoski. I want to inspire you to catch your own ingredients and make healthy, good, tasty food out of them. Sometimes it's good for camping and camping sites. Sometimes you can even make fancy candlelight dinners. Let's see what we have this time. This is Outdoors Food. This is a different story. Uh, it started as an inspirational video again about how we can catch your own food, fish this time, but it turned out to a, into a kind of a canoe trip and sort of a warning. As I live in archipelago, Finland, uh, the weather can change like really fast. It was really beautiful weather and it's now beautiful again, but the wind just suddenly picked up. And when you're using Indian style canoe, not a kayak, it really doesn't handle itself well uh, in the wind and, and the waves. And uh, I was not in like really real danger, but instead of fishing a couple hours, I fished maybe like half an hour or so. And then I paddled over two hours before I was able to get back. I'm really exhausted now. I actually deserve a beer, but uh, if you want to see another inspirational video of how uh, things can go differently as you planned, go right ahead and watch. I went looking for some morals this morning, but couldn't find any. So let's see if I have any better luck with fishing. The place is not so far, only a couple of kilometers away. So I just had dinner. I didn't pack any snacks with me since I'm only going to be a couple hours and the drive takes a few minutes. This is Pilki, a very small fishing rod that you usually use for uh, ice fishing. But uh, since it's very small, it's actually quite handy to use from canoe. I'm gonna find a little fat worm from here, like this. There we go. Good luck. This is the best. You hear nothing but birds. There is only slightly wind. Beautiful weather, sun shining. I really don't care if I don't catch any fish. I just enjoy this. Beautiful. It's amazing. It's May 1st. Uh, this morning was fairly okay weather. I went to hunt those morals. Very soon it started actually snowing. It didn't snow very long, but it snowed for some time. And it's still fairly chilly, something like plus six. But uh, it's beautiful. Only a few clouds every here and there. The wind blew me to the wrong direction, so I need to change the place for a little while. Oh, it's really blowing up. Pushing me to the wrong direction. I see seagulls. That's a good sign. They should be here after fish. So if they are here, then they should be here as well.
deeper path to um, go around this uh, biggest wind and waves. I'm unsure actually if this is something I'm supposed to be in. But uh, right now I really don't care since this is gonna save me like 20 minutes. So I'm just gonna paddle on and enjoy the view. tougher than I thought. The wind's turning my canoe all the time. It's very difficult to try to keep the track and pedal forward. The wind took me back. I'm actually at the very same spot where I was 15 minutes ago. So let's see when I get back. No more fishing today. in somebody's backyard but that was the only way I was able to do it now now to myself and now to you guys kayak may be one thing but never ever take a Indian style canoe to the sea when the wind is blowing bad it doesn't look so bad here but when you're actually out there it's really really windy let's see this is my second attempt. Go from this haven back to this open sea. It's not even open. But still, it's damn windy. Now that I'm looking this at my laptop, those waves look so small, I'm almost embarrassed. But I can tell you, when I was out there, they looked big. And it was tough. I can really guarantee you that. Oh, uh, yeah, okay, I was. Now I'm in the right direction. I guess I finally made it. my energy so this is surprisingly difficult to still paddle I made it I think I deserve a beer now and I want to emphasize that it wasn't really a storm it was just a uh, really strong wind but uh, kayak and canoe they really are different things and uh, I guess it's a, also different if there are two people paddling but if you're alone it can really be time and energy consuming so like I said I'm really wiped out right now uh, but uh, that was a fun story and uh, who knows what happens next time this is outdoors food.